Hey, how are you? Okay, First of all, I love your dress. Thank you so Looking much. <laughs> Season three, also picked up for four. How, how are yeah. you feeling right now? Oh my goodness, it's been a crazy day. Because yes, we have been working all day. This was our day one of season four. It is the season premiere of season three. And we're here at the Paley Center doing this awesome event. So my goodness, crazy day, long day, a little bit tired. But the energy of it all is keeping me awake. <laughs> Seriously, these guys must keep you in stitches basically. Oh my set. goodness. Honestly, like my voice right now is a little bit tired because I've been not like talking so much, but just laughing so hard all day long. It's a good workout too. It is actually. Yes. I feel like the muscles in here have gotten a lot of, uh, uh, yes. <laughs> I feel like I'd be like, Kevin, more jokes, more, more jokes. jokes. I don't want to go to the gym today. <laughs> What can we expect for season three? Um, well, I guess the biggest thing is um, we're going to finally find out what the heck happened at the end of last year's cliffhanger, who fell off that roof. Um, we're also going to, I mean, what you can expect is, is what we do. You're going to expect lots of jokes, lots of hilarity, um, ridiculous antics, um, crazy fights, um, a bunch of guest stars out of this world. I mean, it's crazy. We, every single episode, we have at least two or three amazing guest stars. Uh, this year, we've got Snoop Dogg and John Singleton and George Lopez and Lance Bass and I mean a crazy list of other people um, and yeah just the jokes that's what you can count on from Real Husbands of Hollywood is that you are going to walk away like you said feeling it feeling it in here feeling it over here you're gonna feel it in your body who's on your celebrity guest wish list um, oh, you know what I think would be awesome is someone so like big, like as big as our show is like Lady Gaga. I think that'd be pretty cool. I mean, we need, yes, to, to really challenge us to step it up because what we do is exaggerations of people's, you know, lives and personalities. I don't know how you really exaggerate Lady Gaga. I don't know how you do that. Like Steven said um, Jay-Z as a new hu Ooh, husband. That would be awesome. Yeah, no way. Jay-Z's not letting us talk about him or his B. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> People who come on our show got to be ready to take some hits. And he not taking no hit. I don't want to be the one trying to swing a hit either. I don't want to do it. Although Cameo by Blue Ivy, how cute would that be? Oh, that would be adorable. <laughs> we got to have Boris's kids on the show a couple of times. Um, so that was adorable. But yeah, I can't see that happening either. That's a good wish, though. That is a good wish list. I like wish that. List. Yes. That's, that's, that's reaching for the list. stars. That's what a wish list is called right there. Wish. That is exactly, that's the definition of a wish list. Beyonce, Jay-Z, and Blue Ivy. And last question. This is kind of about Kevin's journey into fame and the entertainment business. What advice would you give to somebody trying to get into that? Oh, honey, I'm trying to get my own advice. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. <laughs> no, um, honestly, I would just say uh, anybody who is trying to get into this business, I would say my advice is to make sure you're getting into the business for the right reasons, that you really are a lover of whatever it is, whether it's a lover of laugh or a lover of storytelling, a lover of character, but that you um, genuinely care uh, about it because otherwise it'll continually be redefined by other people, whether that be the audience or a director or a writer or your um, opportunities or lack of opportunities. So you got to do it because you love it and for no other reason. Well, thank you. So, so nice Absolutely. to talk to you so much. <laughs> Absolutely. Have a good night. Take care. It was nice to meet <laughs> nice you. Nice to meet you.